Well, the heartbeat of the Bible Chapel is develop followers to Jesus Christ. We love that word develop because it means to bring into reality. And in Christian terms, we call that evangelism. And then to grow and make stronger. For those who have that personal relationship with Jesus Christ, we love to help them take one step further in the relationship with Him. And so we call it discipleship. This is not the Bible Belt. Going to church is not part of the fabric of society. So we're in a unique position to, to really to, to reach into the community. We've seen a lot of people coming to church services after receiving diapers at the diaper drive and or after being involved in the 5K that we did in Washington. So we have seen lives impacted then because they're coming to service and they're connecting. And we're looking to take that same kind of DNA of what's happening at our, our sending campus in the South Hills and replicate that in Washington and Wilkinsburg and Robinson, our, our, our multi-sites. And so we hope that in the community, this is a better place because of where the church has been for 50 plus years. We were probably about four or 500 people back in 1998, but really the, the biggest part of our growth started about 2009. We've doubled in size over the last six years, and a lot of that was fueled by our multi-site strategy. Today, we average probably about 4,200 people a weekend. What I love about the Bible Chapel is that it's a family. You have a sense of belonging. Everybody is so willing to serve and to put others first. And within a short amount of time, I found myself really connected and, and um, investing in other people the way others had invested in me. Since being here, everyone's been super friendly. I got started in the Connect class last fall, and that was kind of like the starting point for me um, to get involved. And that excites me, that we are just not proclaiming his news, but then following through with discipleship. Our big focus right now is on caring for congregants, whether it's the new person in the assimilation process or whether it's that ongoing maintenance care for people. The megachurch client program has helped us in making strides and using technology to help in ministry. We've got Sylvia and people that just, they understand our environment. They understand our personalities at church. They understand what we're trying to accomplish. And just having somebody to work with as we grow into new areas, you know, we have multi-site. So as we've gone out to new campuses and trying to figure out how to structure our data and, and so forth. I really enjoy working with the Bible Chapel. To me, this is part of my ministry in helping the church fulfill their ministry. We've kind of reached a point where we need to do something different. You know, our first preference would be to do that with the ACS. We invited Bible Chapel to come here to our headquarters. We sat down with people from R&D, with implementation. They discussed what their needs are. We showed them what we currently have and they gave us some feedback. It was wonderful collaboration. We looked at screenshots of Realm and the problems and issues that we were trying to solve. They showed us right on the screen exactly how we could do that. The Megachurch Client Program provides that great relationship with ACS Technologies where we can work with them together and just plan for the future. It's more than just tracking people's giving, it's more than tracking people's attendance. It's really to be able to care for and increase our, our congregational care, if you will, and, and the technology is a big aspect of doing that.